Hugo, an open source static site generator famous for being the fastest way to render HTML in the world. It was created in 2015 by Steve Francia and is made awesome today by Bjorn Eric Peterson. It's similar to tools like Jekyll and Eleventy, but Hugo is written in Go and achieves sub-millisecond rendering times. It's fun to go fast, but more importantly, it's an extremely powerful content management system. Authors create content by writing Markdown, which gets rendered to HTML based on the structure of the file system. Developers use templates to control how the content is presented. Unlike regular HTML, it uses Go templates to interpolate and transform dynamic data from your content. Templates can define variables, perform loops, fetch remote data, and all kinds of other stuff thanks to tons of built-in Hugo functions. These templates are organized into a hierarchy of layouts to minimize code duplication while maximizing flexibility, and it can even manage relationships between content types thanks to its taxonomy system, making it easy to implement menus, tags, and categories, all without the need for third-party plugins. It's used on awesome some websites like the Cloudflare documentation, Smashing Magazine, and Fireship IO. To get started, install it on your machine, then generate a new site. Create a new web page by writing Markdown in the content directory, or better yet, use the CLI to generate it, which provides a default schema that can be customized in the archetypes directory. Now, at this point, you could install a theme by adding a git submodule to the themes directory, or structure the HTML from scratch using layouts. We might start with a default base of template, which will be rendered on every page and has access to very variables about the site, like page has access to the front matter metadata in the markdown, and site has access to global data that we might find in the config.toml file. Now within the template, blocks can be defined that can be overridden by other templates. For example, the main content is entirely different on a single post versus a list of posts. The single template can simply render the HTML content from the markdown. The list template, though, will need to loop over a range of pages in that directory, then render a truncated preview of the content. The web website will also likely need a sidebar menu, which can be coded as a partial template that can be reused in other layouts. Hugo creates a tree of sections based on your content structure that can be used to build dynamic menus. In addition, it has many other built-in features like syntax highlighting, image processing, multilingual support, and shortcodes. But now, run Hugo server from the terminal to view your site in the browser, and admire that blazingly fast build time. This has been Hugo in 100 seconds. Hit the like button if you want to see more short videos like this. Thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.